Alright, Path of Fire, Chapter 10. Enemy of my enemy. We are now in the desolation, and we have to seek Agent Keto. Desolation here is Elon Riverlands, Crystal Oasis, your starter area. When you come to the desert, you've made your way all the way through here. And now you're here. Commander, how are you alive? Balthazar killed you. I watched from the shadows as you fell. We knew Balthazar was having you watched, but he struck before we could send a warning. What happened after you died? In time, I'll tell you. Where I came to be, what I saw, how I escaped, everything that happened since my death. But first, you must help me. In exchange for that knowledge, absolutely. Anything the Order can do, name it. I want to use Joko's army to stop Balthazar. Commander, the Order of Shadows is powerful, accomplished, capable of near miracles. But we can't deliver an army of Awaken to you. No one, save Joko himself can do that. Archon Ibaru could. The Archon? I... I suppose Joko's marshals might follow the orders of the Archon, if those orders came from the King himself. I have it on the best authority that they would. But the Order has no sway with Archon Ibaru. The last time we caught Joko's attention, he killed 30 of our agents. I'll take care of Ibaru. I just need to know where to find him. And Joko's marshals. I suppose Grand Vizier Udumishi in the Bone Palace to the south would know where the marshals are. As for the Archon, the fastest and safest way to engage him would be to lure him here. But he usually considers the area south of the Wall unworthy of his attention. If he thought the Sunspears were rebelling down here, he'd have to come running to end the threat, right? There aren't enough Sunspears left to stage an uprising. Only takes one, and they don't have to be a Sunspear. A few attacks on awakened camps, some conspicuously placed Sunspear banners, that would look like a Sunspear declaration of war, no matter who was responsible. It's risky. Very risky. Be careful, Commander. Your next death could be your last. Alright, we need to replace Joko's portraits on buildings, right awakened camps, fly the banner, each one has a bar that you need to fill. And as you can see, you've got this whole area to work with. Well, as here. Hard, I imagine. But they're all criminals, so I suppose that's fitting. True. But what if you kept going north? What do you think past that? You've got stars, as you can see. Just interact. Here's a perfect spot to start a fake revolution. And of course, for each banner that you change, you'll have to fight.
This one's for you, Archon. Here's the last two. Looks like a rebellion's brewing. Okay, Beru. I dare you to come take this down. Now, you gotta raid the camps. As you can see, here, here, and here. Again, all you need to do is fill the bar to finish the task. For the camps, as you saw, all you have to do is just capture it.
There's the banner. Banners are up, the camps are down. That should get Ibero's attention. Now to the Bone Palace. To wait.